Oh my god, it's time to talk about the Hunger Games. But we're not going to do it here. We're going to do it tonight on Ustream, not on Blog TV. I'm sorry that I keep changing this on you, but we just had this awesome HP Alliance call on Ustream, and the people at Ustream were having a problem. They helped us fix it on a Sunday, which means they're awesome, and I pledge my undying devotion to them. So tonight at 6 p.m. on Ustream, link in the sidebar, we're going to talk about the Hunger Games. Oh my god, it's going to be so much fun, and we'll talk about other things. Yes, Nerdfighters, I know you want to talk about Paper Towns. I know you do. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know you do. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. How amazing was that song? Everybody watching this has seen Hank's latest song, right? On the Vlogbrothers channel. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I can't stop singing it. I'm scaring Lushka. It's bad. Have you guys seen also the, um, How to Get Boys to Like You video? It's, it's favorited on this channel, and if you haven't seen it, you should go watch it, because, um, I would put it up there with J.K. Rowling's post about weight and girls. In a different, in a different, in a different way, in a different category, but it's, um, you know, there are good people to look up to in this world if you look hard enough. But it's, um, for someone who knows he's speaking to an audience of largely teenage girls, that's a pretty awesome thing to put up, and I give props. My admiration for those two kind of grows every day, and it's awesome. This week, Tonks and the Orvis was in my house. If you've seen my personal channel, link in the sidebar, Tonks and the Orvis was here, and we had a lot of fun playing guitar, and she played a song, which I'm going to put in this video for you to hear, and by the way, YouTube, she is our friend and gave us explicit written permission to put this performance of her song in our channel. Okay, thank you. Well, the Potter Test channel made me think of this. Ooh. So, this is off of my new EP, which actually got named by John Green on your show. Mm. He mentioned wanting something named Tonks for the Memories, yeah. so I named mm. my EP that because I couldn't think of a name for my EP. Um, and this is available to EP 2009. Yeah, the EP of the Horse Club. Um, and this is a song about Charlie Weasley. Um, Charlie Weasley, you're so dreamy. Two years together, this might be love. But now you're leaving for Romania, and I may never see you again. Because it's becoming clear. Charlie Weasley doesn't really love me, he only loves his dragon, and I know he's never gonna change. That song that you just heard from Tom Smears is on her EP, EP of the Month, wizardrockclub.com. Awesome things for awesome charities, always. Here is my question of the week. It's not so much a question as it is a challenge. I want you to pick a Harry Potter character, guys, and write a haiku about them. For those who might not know, a haiku is five syllables, seven syllables, and five syllables. So there's three lines. Five syllables, seven syllables, and then five syllables. Can't wait to see what you came up with. Here's my haiku. Ginny with red hair. She of Harry so despaired. Then she won the end. As for John not putting up his video on Thursday, it's my personal opinion that he actually had a choice between do I put up my video or am I just the guy who gets the funny punishment and everybody laughs at him. And you know what? I think the punishment for that is to be completely ignored. Don't forget, live show tonight on Ustream where the main topic of discussion will be The Hunger Games by Suzanne Collins. It's going to be spoilery, so I hope you've read it. It's the kind of book that makes you think of a famous quote by Oscar Wilde. The suspense is terrible. 
I hope it will last. That's this book. And we will see you tonight, 6 p.m.